Okay, so welcome to part two of the firewall build. So you can see here I've finished off the painting and started to assemble small parts like this front panel here. Now I had to remake a cover to go on the front here um, where the power switch, reset switch and status LEDs are. That's fairly easy to, uh, to do. It's a small piece of card and then on top of it is, um, is some vinyl print. I have some A4 vinyl slides which you can print onto. And then on the side there just a logo. The tray itself, nothing fancy, it's just been painted. Just primed and then sprayed white. And then the lid, also primed and sprayed white, but with, uh, with my logo on the top there. Also done the rack ears. And I'm ready to get installing the motherboard and the rest of the components. Okay, so now everything's back inside. I'm going to talk a little bit about the upgrades that I'm going to make to this unit. So currently, we have one gig of RAM mentioned in a previous video, um, and I've ordered three other sticks. They're here. Uh, so I'm going to insert the other three gig of RAM, and in the front here was situated this blower here. Um, now the problem with this blower was it is incredibly noisy. I'm going to do a demo of the noise that this blower makes. I'm not sure whether this particular blower is faulty or whether all of these particular blowers are this loud. It is rated at quite high decibels so they could all be this loud but this has sort of a slight grinding noise to it as well. I think maybe the bearings have gone in it. Uh, nevertheless I have ordered four little fans uh, and if I can't fit all four on the front here I'll put three at the front and there's another fan header on the back here so I'll perhaps put one on the rear but the CPU usually runs quite cool um, the CFM flow from the four fans is almost equivalent to the blower so we shouldn't have any problems so I've just literally placed the lid on top of the case there, um, just to give a fair comparison. So I'm going to turn the device on and demonstrate the noise that the blower makes. So you can see there, <laughs> it's very noisy. And I'm going to replace it with the fans that I've just shown. So I'm going to take this fan out, install the 4 gigs of RAM and try and work out now where I can install these fans. So I've finished installing the fans, I've put 3 in the front here, they're not permanently attached yet. And I've just put one here. I'm not so sure whether the lid is going to be able to close. I may have to move this fan, but I'm going to try it where it is for now. Even if it's just touching on top of the lid. And we're going to turn this on. And check that everything runs okay. Okay, so I've done some testing with the temperatures uh, with the device in this configuration and everything seems quite stable. 
So I'm going to keep the configuration that I have now, try and keep that fan where it is there. If not, I might have to move it if it causes too much problems with closing the case. Um, and on the front here, these three fans, I'm going to seal them into position and manage these cables here. And I need to manage the rest of the cables, tidy up this here. Install a PCI riser and PCI card in the back. And then we'll be ready to image this device. So thanks for watching. If you've liked the video, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to watch the rest of the series. I'll be releasing a video a week in this series. The next part of the series will be imaging and setting up this firewall.